Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. It actually blah, feels blah, blah. like fall. Not where you are. I mean, it might where you are. I don't know. We've, we're, we are in many, 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 many countries, cities, towns, and provinces all over the globe. I think you're saying it feels like fall in L.A., which is 70 degrees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not fall for anyone. No, it's else. like it's like sixty five in the morning, and I'm like, ooh, I need a long sleeve shirt. <laughs> and then it'll be eighty later <laughs> in the week. It'll be day. eighty later in the week. Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex of Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram Twitter, Twitter for more juicy content. content. Thank you for your Patreon. Follow us if you don't subscribe, like button. Welcome back to Spooky Month. Uh, today ooh. we're doing a movie review of. Dracula, sir, must be polite. <laughs> Always refer to him as sir. Otherwise, he'll bite your peepee. That's true. Uh, and uh, it's a film from uh, a few years ago, 2020. I remember people saying they wanted to wa us to watch it when it came out. Speaking of which, we're about to go into 2025. Yep. That means COVID was five years ago. Bring it back. I have nostalgia. Uh, uh, Isn't that wild? That it was wild. five. Feels like it was last uh, Thursday. I remember anyway. people talking about it when it came out. Um, but it's a Bengali film, mm -hmm. and so it might be our first Bengali horror. No, we did a watch along of one. Oh yeah, no. What are we saying? We love that one. Yeah, that one was great. We did the watch along yeah, of that, that uh, 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 horror and slash also, comedy. This is um, it's psychological more than horror. I'd say. For sure, uh, but it's horror adjacent at minimum. Uh, yeah, it has elements it, that are yeah. horror. Yeah. Elements. It's, that I, are I think it's like most Indian films. You, horror, you're, you're adjacent. Not... <laughs> horror adjacent. Horror uh, yeah. adjacent. But came on 2020. Uh, Bengali, directed by and written by Dabaloi Bhattacharya, and uh, starring Anurban Bhattacharya, Mimi Chakraborty. What? There's a Chakraborty. There's lots of. Uh... Do you think there's ever been a Bengali production that didn't have a Chakraborty in it, or a Mukherjee? So what are the other? What are the odds? What are the odds? that It's you, funny. You had an entire Bengali production without a Mukherjee or Chukaburti. So my wife's maiden name I bet it's never is Mukherjee, right? Yeah. And our new friend who is Bengali and she's an actress, her first name is Kunkana. What do you think her last name is? Mukherjee. If it's not Mukherjee. Yeah, Chatterjee. It's Chakraborty. Chakraborty, yeah. Yeah, Chatterjee's another one. Yeah. That's a good one. Anyways, uh, this will be a 100% spoiler review because it came out a few yeah. years ago. It's on uh, platforms. I don't know which one. It's, if you speak Bengali and you're in the United States, you can watch it on Hulu yeah. without subs. Uh -huh. If you're not, you have to go through other avenues. Right. Like us. Right. So, 100% uh, spoiler review. If you haven't watched it, please go watch it. Come back. And then, uh, Rick, your initial thoughts of Dracula, sir. By the way, we're doing a movie review. <laughs> I it's been a while since I did. I know, but I've, I've, I I haven't yeah. done this because usually you're doing watch alongs. Yeah, watch alongs now. And for that, I, I sing. So the question is does it get a medal? And if it does, what kind of medal does it get? Well, I'll tell you. I'm reaching for the medals. I'm giving it a bronze. Mm -hmm. And I'll explain why I'm giving it a bronze. For those of you who don't know, if it's a bronze film, and this will pretty much say it all, it's I, I see the attempt, mm -hmm. I see what they did. It doesn't necessarily work for me to the extent that I would want to watch it again, but I I will I want to applaud certain aspects, which I'll get into. If it's a if it's a silver, I really liked it. I might not watch it again, but I might. Gold is obviously I would yeah. watch it, recommend it. Platinum is it's one of the best films of the year, and I want to put it in a time capsule. Uh, this for me, uh, man, it was a struggle because there were so many things about it that I thought were flawed. At the same time, I felt like everybody was giving it their ample best. It gets high marks for its attempt at originality. Mm. Um, but more often than not, it was hit. It was missing for me. And I really felt like with some tweaks, the story could work. But that's all for now. We'll get into more of that in a minute. But that's my basic takeaway gotcha. from it. Um, mine's probably pretty similar. Um, I love the concept. I think it's an absolute brilliant concept of the film. Um, I think it wasn't executed properly. Maybe they bit off a little more than they could chew. Pun intended. Yeah, yeah, exactly. In terms of the concept, I think a lot of it might have been a little too convoluted in terms of like, I think it could have been a lot simpler. It's my favorite part of, that's the bronze for me. Is yeah, I think it could have been a lot The concept simpler. and the story and the attempt at what they were trying to do. It, it felt... 
Have you ever read any of Anne Rice's books, Interview with a Vampire? No. Or anything like that? No, I never did those. It really, it wouldn't surprise me if our writer-director is an Anne Rice fan. It, it has, and this is a compliment, it has, it wants and attempts to have in its DNA the Interview with a Vampire uh, yeah. stuff. Anytime I can stay watching a film and work my way through it and I'm not looking at my watch and go, it's, you know, that's why it gets a medal for me. Otherwise, yeah. it's a not worthy. But I'm with you. It's the it's the concept. Yeah, the concept is I, I think it's the, it's a brilliant concept of this kind of almost psychological thing going on in this guy's head. Thinks he's turning into a vampire. What's real? What's not? You know, yeah. what is is this his story? Kind of. I like that a lot. I also like and, and there we, was a lot of elements that I did really enjoy. We're, we're spoiling this because it's been, yeah it's a okay. spoiler yeah I also liked that you're 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 trying to follow what's going on and you find out in the end oh what was really going on because yeah. it sometimes you're thinking are we looking at him as a vampire living through ages mm -hmm. are we looking at this being a reincarnation story yeah or are we just looking at this guy's crazy yeah and it had all three yeah. There's a lot of viably really, presented. There's a lot of really good elements to this. I think where my biggest issue, um, and we'll get into all the other elements uh, as well, but the biggest issue, I think it got too complicated almost. Like it, it got ahead of itself. I think it could have been a lot simpler, and you wouldn't have missed anything. And I think it, you actually would have gained um, uh, appreciation for the film. Um, like there was a lot of different elements. And I'm like, dude. I don't know if we needed that it was like that didn't feel like it was and also uh, it's kind of random i don't know mm -hmm. if that worked right uh, right for me at all um but i as an attempt for a very very original story hats off uh because i think i think it's probably one of the more original horror uh attempts that we've seen um because it, it's just a very different a concept and then they did a lot of stuff like when, when he bit into her neck i was like ah, yeah, i love this and then, like all the kind yeah. of practical blood that the they practical did, blood was really I nice it was really cool yeah and the one when he bit into the guy and it's just squirting everywhere yeah. i was like okay yeah we're going there and there was a lot of stuff that i just i feel like they should have made it simpler the, I, the lead guy i thought did a very 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 good job i yes i, I did really enjoy his performance um i think it would have been cool to play this kind of role with those in your mouth, because I was like, what's going on? And I was like, oh, he has fangs in his mouth. That makes yeah. sense. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I, I thought he did a really good, I thought he had a lot of really good moments. Me too. I think he carried the film a lot of times. Me too. Um, hats off to him. I think this is our first time. Yeah. Is it I our think, first time ever I, seeing I him? I think it is. Yes. I oh, think wait. it is. Why did I say Hold it like on. that? I think oh, it no. is. He was in that other horror film. Oh, he was. Yeah. Oh. Oh, well, fancy that. Whoa. I had no idea. Hold on. What was he in that? Hold on. Oh, he was the director. Oh, he, he wrote and directed that one? <laughs> yeah. Well, isn't that funny? <laughs> All right. <laughs> cool. Yeah. He, he likes horror. I think he should uh, continue to do hey. some. Keep going. Yeah, you guys, that was a very well directed film. Very well directed. Uh, that the, was two years we're after that. Say the name so people yeah, know what we're talking about. Uh, Balapuro Ropokoto. We did a watch along of it, so if you'd like to go uh, see the watch along mm -hmm. uh, for the two Bengalis that it's watch on Patreon. it, um, you can head over there and, and, and watch that. Uh, I didn't know that he was the director. Okay, cool. Yeah, me too. Uh, I think this is our first acting, though, from him. Unless I'm wrong, you guys can let me know. Yeah. Um, but I, I liked him a lot. I actually thought. Almost all the performances were very, very good. I thought so, too. Um, uh, maybe there was like a supporting or two or characters that wasn't amazing, but I think everybody did a very, very good job. Um, like I said, I, I think artistically, a lot of the film was very well done. I think it was just the writing kind of almost let itself down or wanted to be too complicated. Yeah, and it had some moments that were, I thought, okay, that doesn't, that feels, um, for lack of a better term, mm. staged rather than occurring mm. in the moment. Okay. There's there's moments you can see, and there's a lot of reasons for that. It, it's 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 writing. Sometimes it's acting. Sometimes it's just set. Sometimes it's costuming. Sometimes it's all of the above. There are moments from time to time throughout it where you can sense 
a staging of something versus an occurring. The occurring is where you're just following it and everything's believable 100% of the time. The, the biggest, because the story's so original and because he was so invested, it, I really felt like he was so fully invested in this character. He had done his homework into this character. He had really... I mean, I don't know if he's method adjacent or not, but I wonder what things would have been like on set for him. I really felt like he gave this everything he had. Yeah. And, and, and that's the kudos is that attempt. It was very reminiscent of Joaquin Phoenix Joker style of movie. Very yeah. psychological. Very psychological. Um, Doesn't and, start that way, though. At no. first, you think you're getting a pretty straightforward story. Yeah. And then you realize, oh, this is how much of this is just going on in his head. Yeah. Um, it was very that style of story, which I liked. Um, I think it could have been simpler, like the original, like not the original Joker, but yeah. like Joaquin's original first Joker. I haven't seen the second one, <laughs> so I, which yeah. I I'm <laughs> I've had a lot of stupid babies because I'm doing stuff on my personal channel again. Mm -hmm. I'm, I, they, they've asked me to review it. I really want to. I just don't want to give it my money. I, so I'm I'm waiting. I'll watch it when it's streaming because it's going to come to streaming real quick. I think it's actually at the end of the month. Yeah, it's coming real quick. Because it's 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 not going to be in theaters probably past this weekend. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. Um, but yeah, that's like, and I also looking back on it after you see the film and you think about everything that you saw, how much of what we saw was really occurring versus figments of his imagination. Even I think a lot of it was in his head. Even when he went to the dentist, because mm -hmm. you're thinking, bro, if you've always had fangs, go get them filed. What in the world? But when you get toward the end, you're thinking. Did he even go to the dentist? Mm -hmm. Was that just all in his head? Are the fangs even? Are the fangs even just a, in his head? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that um, it's... Uh, I mean, this could all be going on in his head and he's in an asylum somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> and I I could see, like, because I know there's a lot of people that were, like, jumping up and down for a long time for us to watch this because they, they really love it. And I can actually see why people would love this movie. I can, um, especially for... An industry that doesn't get a lot of attention. Exactly. And the originality of it, the, the genre not being represented, I think this is a pretty, again, another reason why it gets the bronze. I think it's a pretty ballsy thing to do. This is not the kind of film that their audiences are particularly asking for. And yeah. just somebody, you wanted to make this. So it looks like this is this director's, the third film, first big film, though, mm. it looks like. Um, it looks like he has two others, and then he did a bunch of TV before this. Yeah, and I can see why this would be a silver or even a gold for some people, yeah. particularly Bengali cinema Especially lovers. if you got more of it than we did. And like, if we're just, we we saw stuff and we just didn't understand it, and obviously you can explain that. Um, I just, like I said, if I, I think I've repeated it a few times, it, it just got, I think, too ahead of itself, too convoluted. Um and I think it could have simplified the story a little bit. Which is also a testament to how difficult it is to take a concept, turn it into a script, and then take that script and turn it into good something film. on film. Yeah. We so yeah. frequently can see a good film, and you take for granted how difficult it is to make not just a good film, but to make a great film mm -hmm. for, for all of the elements that come into play the decisions that have to be made on the day and then you have decisions that have to be made in editing everything from what we're going to do with the runtime did that work did it not work did we get the sounds do we have to do adr it, and for a concept like this I, don't, I wonder how stressful this was to try to get this accomplished and see that final film be what you had been envisioning this yeah. is this is not a this is not a simple film to try to undertake that's why i know a lot of like film bros like inceptions like their favorite movie ever and i love inception i do too uh but it's such a high concept film yeah to get that to come out on screen and everybody like that was amazing as is um good grief but he did with the m uh megalopolis no 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 <laughs> that's a nolan. high concept film nolan the one you haven't oh, seen tenet. no N the one you haven't seen the early one he did one of his first films. Memento. Memento. Oh, yeah, I haven't seen that. You'd like Memento. Yeah, I haven't seen It's that. another thing where it's Nolan's, it's concept. Yeah. Um, I mean, he's great at that. He's, he's pretty a... much the master of taking really yeah. difficult conceptual storytelling and making yeah. it followable. Yeah. For the, for the, for the regular <laughs> yeah. person watching except, a movie. Except for Tannant. <laughs> that didn't work for me. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I don't think it was complicated either. <laughs> that that one for me was like, huh? Well, you're very stupid, Rick. It's true. Very stupid. Born stupid, stand that way. Um, but yeah, uh, you guys let us know what you thought about the movie. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, what your thoughts on it are. Um, do you agree with our opinions? Uh, what should be our next Bengali film yeah. that we should watch, whether horror or otherwise? And what else does he have? Because we've now Literally appreciated him as an actor and as a director-writer. So, We're uh, talking about... Uh, yeah, uh, Anurban Bhattacharya. And I know I'm mispronouncing also, that. Also, is name. he related to the director? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. That, uh, I I've like, not heard that name often. Doesn't mean it's not a common name. Correct. But, but it's not as like Chakraborty, which... Right, you know, or I Banerjee. Ass- yeah, I wouldn't assume you're related just because you have the same name, right. Chakraborty. But that name, uh, I wonder. Is he more of an actor or a director? Uh, what's he more known? Or is he, right. just, or is he just like um, Fafa? I mean, yeah. Fafa. Um, Farhan. Yeah. Director. Very good director. Very good actor. We also didn't mention this, but Will. Uh, score was lovely. Yes, it was. The score was did a really nice job. I thought the coloring uh, yeah. and the editing on it were very good as well. It was one of those things where I, wa- I think about this all the time when I watch footage from stuff that's a smaller industry or a smaller film. Yeah. And I look at it and I think, is this something that I would want to have on my reel? And people here in Hollywood would look at that and go, wow, that was obviously... Netflix, Amazon, Disney, it looks like that quality. The cinematography and everything, the finished product, high quality. Yeah. Looked really nice. There's so much, like I said, there's if if the concept worked fully, I could see it being a gold uh, easily for I me. I do too. Uh, and I honestly because everything else was there. I I honestly think you could and has anybody ever done this? Has anybody gone and seen their finished film and thought Man, we could really do this and do that, and then just went back and did a remake ten years later of their own film. Because you could, I mean, you could go back and look at that and say, "They've released Here's how the we can Snyder I- cut, <laughs> <laughs> different, <laughs> different <High> concept cinema." <laughs> so anyway, yeah, my favorite thing is the concept. Yeah, it's a great concept. Uh, let us know about your thoughts about the movie, um, and what should be our next Bengali review? Yes, please. Watch. Yes, and please. anything else we need to know. Down the below, blah, blah, blah. Ooh.